Hello, welcome to another maths video. Uh, today we're going to be looking how integers uh, relate to uh, graphs uh, uh, coordinates. So on a graph we typically see an x-axis which is horizontal and a y-axis which is vertical. Uh, we always look at our starting point here, the zero, which is at the, the center of this cross and whenever we go upwards, like in the previous video we saw, we go upwards, we can go keep going until eventually we go into space. And that will be the distance from ground level. And if we jump into the sea, we can dive deep down the depths below the surface uh, of the sea. And that will be all our negative int uh, numbers. And we already know that when we go to the left of zero along the a horizontal axis we're going to go into negative numbers so the rule to remember is that everything to the left of zero and everything below the zero going downwards is going to be negative numbers and the opposite is going to be true uh, for positive numbers all right so when we look at a pair of coordin uh, coordinates a coordinate is a set of numbers uh, on this x y axis and let's just say we have a point here where we have a value of 2 and a value of 3. Uh, typically this value would be uh, starting with the x value and the y value. So the first thing uh, that they're looking at here is they want to they want you to plot these coordinates on this chart. So we're going to look at our x uh, value because the first value in this coordinate pair is the x value and the second is the y we want to first deal with the with the x so we're going to go on our x number line we can see that it's a positive 2 so we're going to be on this side of uh, the the axis and we're going to be starting at 2 so our first point is going to be somewhere along here Then we're going to look at our y-axis, and we're going to see that it's a positive 3. So we're going to go from 0, and we're going to look at our y-axis, which goes up and down. It's a positive number, so we're going to be going upwards, and we go to 3. And we just draw a little line across there as well. The point at which these two lines meet is called an intersection. And that's where our actual point is going to be. So the coordinate point of A is going to sit here between 2 on the x-axis and 3 on the y-axis. If we had another example, uh, <coughs> let's say it's B, and they wanted us to plot minus 1 and minus 3, remember that the first value is an x, and the second value is a y. We're going to look at our x-axis first. We're going to be in the negative side, so we're going to be here, minus 1. Then on our y-axis going upwards, we are going to be plotting uh, minus 3. So we're going to be going down until we reach minus 3, which is here. And that's going to be our next point. This is going to be point B. So you can clearly see how easy it is to determine the integer points uh, on an actual uh, graph and how uh, you can distinguish between the positive and the negative ones by looking at the direction that the arrow goes in. So everything on the bottom of the horizontal line will be negative and everything to the top will be positive and everything to the left will be negative as we've already learned. 